We're told Sam needs to sign 300 copies of their new novel. They sign the copies at a constant rate. After 15 minutes, they have signed 20% of the copies. Which of the following equations models the number of copies of Sam's new novel N left to sign T minutes after they started signing? So pause this video and see if you can have, the, have a go at this on your own. All right, now let's work through this together. So when I look at the choices, we have an exponential for choice at A, a an exponential for choice B, and then we have two linear functions for choices C and D. Well, they tell us that they sign, Sam signs the copies at a constant rate. So for signing at a constant rate, an exponential is not going to be describe either how many we have signed or how many are left to sign. So we can immediately rule out choices A and B. So to figure out between these last two choices, let's set up a little table here where we know that T is in minutes and N is the number of books left to sign. And they tell us after 15 minutes, they have signed 20% of the copies. So after 15 minutes, what's N going to be? Well, N is the number of books left to sign. So that means that there's 80% of the books left to sign 80% of the original number of books, 80% times 300, is going to be 240 books left to sign. So let's see which of these choices is consistent with that. So 300 minus 4 times 15, let's see, 300 minus 4 times 15, that does indeed look like 240, so this one's looking good. What about 300 minus 20 times 15? Well, 20 times 15 is 300. So that means that n would be zero here. We know that Sam doesn't have, isn't done signing after 15 minutes, so we could rule this choice out, and we like choice C.